Are you tired of getting blisters on those knickknack toes of yours? Well, this video could help you out. Perfect. Hello there broskies, Erkin back here yet again. And this video is very different to say the least. I think this is the first time I've actually reviewed socks on the channel, but they're no ordinary socks. But just like a full start, we have to go right back to the beginning and start off where it all began in this little story. So throughout the years, I have been involved in sports one way or another. Through football, gym, athletics, you name it, I've done it. My actual trade alongside talking about trainers is of course a sports coach. So my friend Cass, shout out to Cass, I will include him in the B-roll as well, shout out to him. He actually sent me a link out of the blue about these certain socks and I was very intrigued. These grip socks as a lot of people call it and of course the company are too they are actually becoming a lot more popular i think i was watching man city's all or nothing documentary on amazon prime and i saw some of the footballers wear them and because i saw that i was paying a lot more attention to some footballers socks and these professional footballers were wearing them a lot more than i initially thought and there's a big reason for that not only do these socks prevent blisters and sores underneath your feet, but they give you a very good advantage in terms of the grip in your shoes or boots, whatever you're wearing. And before getting these socks, I used to wear two sets of socks just because I didn't want as much wiggle room in my football boots. But honestly, I'm not even working with this company. It was just out of the blue that I bought these on Amazon. And this particular pair, I will leave a link down below if you wanna grab yourself a pair. But I played with them the first time yesterday at a football match and these are actually heaven sent. They made such a difference to my feet, especially during the match. Normally my big toe more so than anything would be burning throughout my running. And honestly, these made such a difference. And the brand I did end up going with was called Emuki. And I just like the look to these socks. They're very sporty and they're not trying to do too much. There were some brands that were actually cheaper, but I feel like they were doing a bit too much in terms of how they looked. Now going into the specifics of the actual socks themselves, Themselves. From what I know, the whole of the sock is primarily of cotton, of course, for breathability and comfort. But underneath the sole, we of course have those rubber pads to prevent slipping and give you a lot more grip in your boots. And a couple things I did actually like on this pair in specific was the elasticated look. We have it on the ankle and of course the midfoot. Now with these socks, I really feel that some of these sports would need these, such as dance, basketball, football slash soccer, whatever you want to call it. Any any movements that include high intense changing of direction, I feel like this would help you out so, so much. And trust me, I'm not trying to sell people on these too much. I was very skeptical about them at first as well, but after yesterday and playing like I did, I'm not gonna say it's because of the socks, but you know, they helped they helped. Now I know socks aren't really the most exciting thing to think about. It's one of those dreaded presents for Christmas. I know, I know, I've been there. But if you're participating in any intense sort of sports and you're always sore underneath your feet and toes, then this could really, really help you. I am actually curious to try out other brands as well, just because I like to have a variation of things. But in terms of my personal experience, I am really happy I picked these up. If only I had these socks when I was younger, if only. You know what they say, better late than never. I'm telling you, I used to wear football socks all the time when playing football, and they used to cause so many blisters on my feet, honestly, it wasn't a pretty sight. Now, one of the only negative things I did find with these socks that isn't really a negative once you're used to them is when you're putting your feet with the socks on into your football boot or running trainer. Because there's so much grip, it feels like it's stopping you from actually putting them in. But once you've figured it out, you should be okay. How I figured it out, I just widened the whole boot or shoe just to make a bit more room for your foot initially when you put them in and once they're in you don't even feel the difference but anyways broskies i am going to leave you on that note if you have any questions or just want to show me some love then instagram is the place to do so and if you haven't already don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and of course until the next episode take care